November 1st of 2022. Um, a day that I know I won't forget. And a lot of people in hip hop culture, a lot of people in the world will not forget. It's a shame that on February 6th, we're still, still sitting here talking about this man and not allowing him to rest peacefully. Jay Prince and Offset apparently had some words to share with one another when it came in regards to this takeoff passing that happened in Houston. Yo, YK, W, T, F, G, O, man, you got J, and I'm back. I'm back for another EC News segment today, man, and and this one I um is gonna be brief, um, and I'm not gonna, I don't I don't have too many personal opinions. I have a personal opinion on this, but I'm not that not one that I'm really gonna share. How about that? Offset, J Prince, they done went back and forth a couple times over the past few days, um, and it's seeming as if. J Prince, you know, and Mob Ties and everyone that was in Houston, um, they did an interview with Million Dollars Worth of Game. And, you know, they've been doing quite a few interviews since the passing of, of Takeoff. Um, and you know what? Before I even get into it, I'm going to just let y'all see what J Prince had to say. I'll go ahead and check that out. But, um, it's offset, dude. I ain't going to leave him out. You know, I'm just real like this, you know, because... You know, you know, niggas be throwing rocks and hiding their hand, right? They be throwing rocks and hiding their hand. And uh, I don't like them kind of individuals, you know. And, and the truth of the matter is, you know, one can, can dance and different things in front of these different cameras and, and all that kind of shit. And, and, re, and, and when reality, the truth of the matter is, you know, Nigga, you wasn't really right there with takeoff when he was alive. You know what I mean? So for you to be taking these positions that you taking, you know what I mean? And I, I got people everywhere, so I hear all kinds of things. Uh, I'm going to just say this to you. Uh, I'm going to just say this to you. Uh don't never put me in no position where, you know, I have to defend myself. You know what I mean? That wouldn't be healthy for you. And, you know, I, I have to say that. I hate, but it's a million dollars worth of game. You know what I mean? It's a million dollars worth of game, and I'm going to give it to him right on a million dollars worth of game because I ain't going to throw rocks and hide my hand. I'm going to just let it be known, you know, to him because I hear what's being said. And uh, it's all love after that. Now, this is the thing when it comes to what he just said. Mm. Mm. I don't know, man. You got to be. No, you know what? Forget that. Let me just go ahead and show y'all what Offset said. Hey, first off, y'all niggas speaking on my real brother. I don't know what y'all niggas got, what the fuck y'all niggas got going on. Y'all niggas speaking on my real brother. How dare one of y'all niggas even speak on me and Tate relationship, nigga? I don't know you niggas from a can of paint, nigga. Y'all niggas don't know how me and my brother rock, nigga. You trying to clear your face, nigga. You done, this your fifth interview, nigga. You done did about my brother, nigga. You ain't think about his mama. You ain't think about the family, nigga. We ain't said nothing. Ain't nobody said nothing but you niggas. You niggas, man, who y'all nigga think y'all nigga is? John got it, nigga. Ain't nobody going for none of that, bro. I ain't starting none of that shit y'all nigga talking about either. And if you heard something from me, I'm going to tell you it's, it's, it's going to come from me. Call my phone. Y'all nigga going off of he say, she say. Then y'all nigga supposed to be this is who, who y'all supposed to be. And y'all nigga on interviews and it out on an interview. Talking about, I said, then nigga, call my phone, homie. You call my phone, we'll have a conversation. They're going to talk about all that plant internet, internet games. I don't Energy. You feel me? Keep my brother's name out your mouth. That's the exact energy that I just got from Offset. And I'm gonna be honest with you. I, I, I'm, I'm kinda, I'm siding with Offset when it comes to this. Um, J Prince, Mob Size, we know everything that they do, the legacy that they hold, you know, for, for everything in hip hop culture. And you know, the connections that J Prince had, you know. From what J Prince said, this is one of the first situations that anything's ever happened like this around them, you know. And he said that basically made it seem like they were the aggressors. That, you know, 
Quavo and Takeoff, whoever they was with, they were the aggressors, which may be true. Or I've, I've seen incidents or reports of that. Um, but he said that anybody that crossed him got to get taken care of. Anyway, Offset, the way I feel for Offset is, like he said, just stop talking about it. Y'all still talking about my brother. It's four, five months in at this time. Y'all still talking about my brother. He's tired of hearing about it. He's tired of even, because you got to you gotta think about it and put, put yourself in their shoes and their predicament. Every time they hear about it, every time, I know every time Quavo hear about it, I know every time Offset hear about it, they're reliving that moment when they found out, when they heard. Just the un, the disbelief of, of like it actually happening. So he tired of them talking about it. And Jay Prince and them, you know, that, that's the crew that they were with. So they firsthand, or or Jay Prince may not have been there, but Jay Prince Jr. firsthand may know what happened. So so I see I see what they're saying, but I I can't help but be on the offset side when it comes to just like, let's just stop talking about it. You feel me? Like, okay, yeah. I know I know I know I know the interviewers want to talk about it. I know I know that they this is their hot topic. You ain't gotta say what you gotta say. All you you got say well which is well which is like offset said. You thought you thought about take off's mama? You thought about the family, you thought about their brothers. Well wishes to the family, and I hope them the best. And that's it. That's all you gotta say. Nothing else needs to go into detail. But look, this is why I'm gonna leave the comments open to y'all. Y'all leave comments. Who do y'all feel is wrong? Do y'all feel that Jay Prince is wrong by talking about it? Do y'all feel offset? Just a little emotional about it. You know, y'all gotta leave comments and join the conversation when it comes to these EC news segments. Um, but no man, I ain't gonna hold y'all much longer. Later, I got to do this reaction, and I don't want to, but I got to do this reaction to uh, Quavo, um, the Without You, Grammy's performance. It's a lot of Grammy's performances I got to actually react to. You know what? I might actually do an EC News segment about the Grammys. Y'all stay tuned. I love and appreciate y'all, man. Press subscribe on the road to a million. Definitely on the road to 20 Press like, comment down below. Y'all distribute. We're about this back.